everyone, how's it going? So in this video, I will talk about how to customize your boombox sound. For those that are new to the channel or haven't owned a Tesla or not aware that Tesla has a boombox. And this feature actually was born from the fact that Tesla was mandated to install a pedestrian awareness sound. So I don't know the exact acronym for it. However, in 2020, all EV, all vehicle that don't make any noise needs to make some noise when in reverse. So that's why now you hear that humming noise when a Tesla vehicle is backing up. So within Tesla sub menu, there's this toy box and there's this application called Boombox. So Tesla took it to another level using that pedestrian awareness speaker that is installed in the front end of the Tesla vehicle, you actually can change the sound of your horn. In this case, we replace the horn sound with La Cucaracha. And if you listen to the preview, it's actually pretty loud. And you know, you can reduce some tension uh, with that sound instead of an actual horn. And it comes with other default sounds for the horn. Ta-da, applause, ba -da tis I don't even know what that is. DJ, let's listen to DJ, what does that sound like? It's actually pretty loud. We added some custom sound, one, two, three, four, five. You can add up to five by plugging in another USB with MP3 files add it to a boombox folder and I'll show you how to do that in a brief moment. So that's the horn sound. You can customize the horn sound adding additional five different horn sound on top of the default and Tesla constantly add new default sounds that you can select from each upgrade, software upgrade. You can also now have sound playing from your vehicle. Now be careful because in certain county it can consider noise pollution so you can get a ticket for that so do check with your local authorities before driving around with sound playing outside of your external speaker because it will not turn off there's no speed limit you can go 80 miles per hour and still have the sound playing through your speaker not that you can hear it from the outside but we did test this out it does not turn off unless you manually turn it off like that okay so so this is similar to that of the horn sound, but while you're driving. So whether you're in reverse, drive, in neutral, on autopilot, this will constantly play until you turn it off. And the custom sound outside of the default. So there's other defaults here on top of what we saw in the horn. Polynesian elevated music. Say rock and roll. So you get the point. Some of the customized sound we, we've been messing around with, and I'll show you how to add this to your Tesla vehicle. We did Lexus LFA. Mando song, the soundtrack from Disney. You know, you can add a uh, spaceship down as well. And then the horn, you can actually select semi-truck horn. So this is how it sounds. I think that should be legal, right? We just stick with La Cucaracha for the horn sound. Driving sound. What's this here? These are examples. So how you set this up is fairly easy actually. So what you need is a USB or USB-C. So I have an adapter. And then you plug it in to one of the USB-C port in your center console. And to program this, you do need a computer. 
and you do need to format the computer. So you're gonna need a jump drive. Any size will do, at least five gig. Then you plug in your computer. This is a PC. And once on your computer, click on control or open up that jump drive folder. Make sure you move any files out because you will right click and then left click on format. The format, I did this prior to the video, but you will go through the whole process by formatting the drive. It takes a few seconds. Left click OK, close out the format application. Now you're going to reopen that jump drive folder. It should be blank and empty. You're going to right click and you're going to create a new folder. Right click and click left click on new and then left click on folder. Now the key here is to name it boombox. One word with the B capital, capitalized and create that folder, open that new folder. And now you can drag any MP3 music over or sound over. I went to the website, Drive Tesla Canada, and they have a good number of MP3 sounds that you can upload to the drive, um, popular sound like Mandalorian. And what you wanna do is download this from your browser and once it's downloaded, you drag over the file into the new folder, the boombox folder. And that's it. You can drag up to five per upload and that will be able to allow the Tesla, once you plug in the USB-C, it will show up on the boombox screen as a drop down. And that's it. Hopefully you found this video helpful. Catch you all next time. And if you're on the market for a Tesla, and if this channel has helped you decide to get a Tesla, please use the link in the description of this video to order your Tesla. That will give you some free supercharging credit. Catch you all next time. Take care.